Aloha. To properly represent the Hawaiian language in print, you need to know two typing tricks. These both work in Mac operating system, Panther, Tiger, and Leopard. So anything 10.3 or higher. If you're a PC Windows user, it is considerably more complicated and you need to consult this page of Wikipedia. The Okina, for you Mac users, is entered in text as a single opening quote, and it represents the glottal stop consonant in Hawaiian. To type this, all you need to do is hold down the Option key and type a closing bracket. Option plus closing bracket. Let's try Hawaii. H-A-W-A-I. Hold down the Option key, type a closing bracket, I. There you go. A macron is a diacritic mark placed over a vowel to indicate that the vowel is long. In Hawaiian, that's called kahako. To do this, first we have to enable the Hawaiian keyboard layout. Go to your Apple menu in the upper left-hand corner, click, hold, drag down, open system preferences. On the top row, look for the flag. In Leopard, it's called Language and Text. In earlier operating systems, it's called International. Same thing, click on that. Look at the menu across the top. In Leopard, we're looking for Input Sources. In earlier operating systems, it's called Input Menu. Click on that. Here's an alphabetical list of all the different language keyboard layouts available. Scroll down alphabetically to Hawaiian and click. Please be sure that this is also checked. Show input menu in menu bar. Close. That's it. To enable the Hawaiian keyboard layout, Go to the upper right hand part of your menu bar. See the American flag that shows you're currently in the US keyboard layout. Click, hold, drag down, and select Hawaiian. Now you're ready to type with a kahako. To do that, you simply hold down the Option button again and type the vowel that you want while you're holding down that button. Let's try Manoa. M. Hold down the Option key, type A, N-O-A. Let's try Waikiki, W-A-I-K. Hold down the Option, click, type I, K. Hold down the Option, type I, and you're done. If you want to continue, you, for example, you have a long document in English, you can always switch back up in the upper right-hand part of your menu bar to the U.S. keyboard again. I don't think it really makes a difference when you're typing in Hawaiian. But in any case, you see that the Hawaiian remains stable. It doesn't switch. So please, I invite you to have fun with this beautiful language, Hawaiian, and mahalo for watching.